I've got a girlfriend, which is nice. I hate being single. Being single is the worst, because when you're single, there's only like two things that can happen. Either you're having sex with nobody. Someone just said, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> this guy gets it. <laughs> so yeah, either you're having sex with nobody, which as she knows, that's very lonely. Or you are having sex with someone new for the first time. And that is just a fucking nightmare. <laughs> Like, this is what happened, I'll break, like, this is about two years ago, I was single at the time, and this girl, a female friend of mine, she, like, called me up out of nowhere. Well, she didn't, <laughs> she didn't call, she texted me, she's not a fucking serial killer. She... <laughs> <laughs> she, she texted me, and she's like, hey, like, me and my boyfriend are on a break. I've always wanted to have sex with you. Do you want to have sex? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's the thing. Like, you might think, like, ladies probably think, like, oh, yeah, you'd be like, yeah, sweet. But here's the thing, ladies. Like, guys, we spend so much time fantasizing about something like that happening. Nobody just wakes up this. I'm happy being single. I like being single. I love waking up every day and being like, am I going to shower? Probably not. <laughs> I went <laughs> So I was like, uh... Eventually, of course, I was like, yeah, you know? Even if it's a trap, I'll die happy. <laughs> so she's like, all right, um, get some booze. I'm coming over. Now, I'm an alcoholic, and I was trying to quit drinking at the time, but when you get an offer like that, you're like, well, I guess it's back to day one tomorrow. <laughs> So she comes over. Now she is giving me digital, verbal consent. Like I have consent, that's very, very important these days. I had consent, so I could have, she said <laughs> right? So I could have opened the door and just like gone for it, right? Been so sexy like Chris Pratt or, I don't know, I don't know who's sexy these days, I'm 30. <laughs> but I could have just like gone for it, right? Just gone for it. But, like, here's the thing, like, I, that's not my style, that's not, like, who I am. What I did is I opened the door and I was like, hey, do you want to play Jenga? <laughs> <laughs> so we played Jenga, we're playing Jenga, and she, <laughs> she, she, like, I lose immediately, right? Because I'm just like, <laughs> <laughs> tower falls. She gets on top of me, she starts making out with me, she's making all the first moves, my kind of lady, and she's making out with me, and then she's like, hey, I like it rough. Yeah. <laughs> so I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> like, I've had rough sex before, but so like, I, I you know, it was like, I start going, but like very light, right? Very, like, I was like, uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Reasons, one, we really care about each other. Uh, you dirty bird, you like this old hog? <laughs> like light, right? It's our first time. We're not gonna be like, oh, you like it rough? That's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> so, so she, she, like, I'm going light, right? And then she's like, she looks at me, she's like, that's cute. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, I think she was trying to emasculate me <laughs> into hitting her harder. <laughs> I was like, oh, you don't understand my reaction to being emasculated by a pretty woman. I'm just gonna start crying. <laughs> And then call you tomorrow and be like, so like, what's the deal between us? 